Hi, I'm celebrity hairstylist Andrew Fitzsimons and brand ambassador for Easy Locks. Today I'm going to show you a couple of different ways to use your celebrity range pieces to achieve red carpet looks. I love them because they're so versatile, we can create so many different looks with each piece and that's why my clients love them too. So let's get started. So for this look, I'm going to use the Superstar. So you're going to want to start off by sectioning your hair from the back to the front, right over your ears. So the back is separated. You're going to back comb the top and the bottom of your back section. You're going to half it and then you're going to take the ends overlap them over each other, cross them over, and then attach them on either side. You're basically just trying to get rid of your hair, hide it, um, and keep it as smooth to the head as possible. So you're gonna want it as flat as possible for when you put on your superstar piece. Then grab your piece, brush it out. It's better to brush it off of your head as opposed to on because you don't wanna tug at your hair too much. Then you're gonna take the comb, and you're going to attach it to the back combed sections at the top and the bottom that you've created. And it attaches securely like so. And that is the bulk of your work. It's that easy. So what you want to do now is blend your hair at the front in with your piece. So you want to back comb the roots so you don't see the start of the piece and then blend over your hair on top of the piece, either with a brush or a comb or just with your fingers. It's very, very easy. And then if you take it to one side, it gives you more of an old Hollywood look. And without adding any front pieces, you're giving yourself more of a side fringe look, more of a layered look at the front. If your hair is a little shorter or you want the piece to give length to the front of your hair, add the additional side piece to the front of your hair, just like so. Clip it on and then brush your hair over it and it instantly brings the front of your hair into the back piece and gives a seamless all over look. The colors blend so perfectly that you would never be able to tell that it was a piece. It instantly gives glamour, it has a beautiful, relaxed wave. Another way to wear it is to part the hair in the middle and have it down on either side, or a side part as you see here. Then another thing that I like to do is take the hair back at the very nape of the neck, just with your fingers very, very loosely so it looks very, very natural, and then attach a bobbin or a hair tie to the hair. You can either leave the bobbin visible. I think that um, makes the piece look even more natural, like it's your hair. I just love how tousled it looks. It looks so natural. Then another option is to take a piece of hair and wrap it around the hair tie for a fancier look. Then just secure it with a bobby pin. So if your hair is a little shorter like our model's is, it might be a good idea to graduate your superstar piece so there's less of a difference in length between your hair and the piece. And for a more beachy look, spray in a little dry shampoo and some Easy Lux rose oil onto the ends for a just out of the ocean look. So warm it in your hands and then just work it through the ends. For a completely different look, I straightened our superstar piece off the head and now I'm going to attach it to the back combed top section of her hair, laying it straight over tucking her hair underneath the piece. And then attaching the very, very bottom. It's as simple as that. So I'm just gonna brush it through, smooth it down. 
for a sleeker look. So I've changed to a middle part, I'm grabbing the little side pieces and attaching them just right underneath the part. One on each side. This look reminds me of 70s Cher. I love it. Look at that. So sleek, so chic, so beautiful. And that was done in a matter of seconds. It's unbelievable. Before, and look at all of the different hairstyles we've created with just the superstar piece. It's amazing. 